No thanks, we're all right. All the best though, thanks. Larry King. What? Are you Larry King? Who wants to know? My name is Elridge. I hear about the rent allowance. Shit, fuck bollocks. I mean, uh, that's great. Uh, sorry. Uh, come on, come on in. So. Uh, how long have you been unemployed? Uh, about three months. What was your last job? Uh, I was uh, worked for O'Donoghue's as a mechanic. Where is that? Uh, Fairview, just up by Richmond Road. It just go past the association and it's just down on your yes, road. Yes, okay. And where they let you go, cutbacks? Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, no, not actually. Sorry? I got the sack. Oh? Yeah, I fucked it up. Okay. It was stupid. Okay. I put the wheel on without the bolts and she crashed. Right. Smashed into a lamppost. You know, baby on board, tears, screams. I just legged it. She was spanner at me. You know, I didn't go back, I was too embarrassed. They never called, I never called. It was a nightmare for the scratcher. Sorry, uh, Dole office. Uh, but uh, they got in touch and, and Sean told them what happened and I, they've got a bit of money coming in in the meantime but it's just a rent you know I, I, I can't I can't live off the scratcher and get paid the rent too it's fucked the whole thing's fucked sorry no no that's fine so uh, you're single uh, yeah and I had a girlfriend okay but I fucked it up okay she could have been the one. Like, I loved her. I, I, I still love her. It just when... Sorry. No, no, that's fine. Relationships can If she hadn't just put so much pressure on me to get hitched, I might have actually got around to the idea. I just wasn't ready. I, or I didn't feel ready. Maybe you never feel. You know, and people just keep going on and on and, and in silence and then nothing ever gets Oh, Christ. Another fucking whining child. Whatever happened to personal responsibility? I really don't think I'm in the mood for this today. I should just ring Claire. Tell her I'm sorry. Making a joke like that about her sister. It was immature and insensitive. She was right. It just wasn't a funny thing to say at all. I should have just apologised straight away and not had a go at her about not having a sense of humour. That said, why does she have to be so serious all the time? I mean, there's more to life. Why don't she laugh occasionally, or for once in a while, crack a fucking smile? Yeah, fuck her. Humorless bitch. I don't even know what to do. Okay, uh, great, single. You think that's great? Sorry? I'm telling you that I can't go outside because of the panic attacks and you think that's great? <laughs> no, uh, sorry. Uh, I just remembered something there and my mind wandered off. I, to be honest with you, if you could just get to the end of the form, I can submit it and hopefully you'll qualify for the rent announce. Hopefully? Well, yeah, I can't approve the claim today. This is fucking bullshit. Is it, who are you? Like, is it, do you know what's going on here? Like, I, I'm fucked. You know, I can't go outside. I have no money. I can't eat. I can't sleep. Okay, Larry. My, I have no job. Larry. My girlfriend left me. Larry. You know, my man's a cunt. Larry, shut the fuck up, you pathetic piece of shit! I just have four more bullshit questions on this pointless form. And then I can get onto my own bullshit. You think you're the only fucker on this planet who's got stuff to deal with? I can't take this shit. Day in, day out. I've already heard your story 14 times this week and it's only fucking Tuesday. So just play the fucking game. Smile. Pretend you got half a brain in that two-year-old underdeveloped pile of mush and answer the fucking questions. So I can go and get an assault rifle and start picking off innocent fucking civilians.
so I shouldn't say anything officially, but uh, I'd say you'll have the rent allowance by the end of the month. A lot of people are in a in a spot at the moment, so we're trying to speed up the process, you know. Oh. Well, it was very nice to meet you, Larry. Um, hopefully things will pick up for you soon. It's just a matter of keeping the chin up, you know, don't give up hope. I'm sure there's a job out there for you somewhere. You seem like a nice enough fella to me. Thanks, I guess. Is there not more questions or...? No, no, no. You, you've already filled out the form. This was really just a you know, courtesy call to make sure it was a bona fide claim. Of course, yeah. Um, right, well, uh, uh, thanks. Yeah. Well, good luck, Larry. Right.